how to set up your own lab on your laptop or computer for practice of cyber security or penetration testing or ethical king so to do the practicals you need few virtual machines and to get the virtual machines you have to install virtual box this is the setup which i always suggest to all my students so here what you have got is your main computer then you have got your main operating system your windows 10 whatever ip it has got it has no relation with the virtual environment then this blue boundary this one is your virtual environment for the practices here step number 1 you will download and install virtual box the version which i always recommend is version 6.1 that is more stable then inside virtual box you will put these settings and after doing that what you need next is your an kali linux machine and the ip address which we will give to that kali linux machine is 10002 and we'll set it up as nat network so this will be our attacker machine and then we need a windows 10 victim machine so we will be installing a windows 10 setup again on nat network a windows 7 virtual machine and a windows server 2016 plus most important you need an android virtual machine so that you can practice that how attacks are happening on mobile devices as well and how to defend them how to make the security better so this is a lab environment these are all the network settings this is the subnet that you will be using i always recommend to make it in 1000 range so that it does not conflict with your main which is usually on 192168 subnets right and these are the ip addresses so i always give dot 2 because dot 1 is always for our router so i always give it dot 2 to kali linux and then dot 10 to windows because it's windows 10 to windows 7 we give dot 7 to windows server we give dot 16 because it's windows server 2016 and to android i always give an ip address dot 9 because it's android 9 based virtual machine so this is a lab setup which you guys can prepare on your laptop on your desktop and you can practice these cyber security labs which we are doing if you are one of our students then all these software will already be uploaded on your premium google drive and these are all the steps which i have explained then these are the settings for network you will make a nat network so click on preferences go to network and click a new nat network click on this green button it will create a new nat network and give it the subnet 10000/24 which means all our virtual machines will derive the ip address from this range and then put static ip addresses on these machines how to make static ip i have also explained so on kali linux go to your machine setting your virtual machine setting select nat network don't select nat only nat network and the name of your nat network so it's not normal nat it's nat network for virtual machine setup for our virtual lab setup then click okay then in here go to kali linux right click on here on this small button for networking click on edit connection go to ipv4 settings and give the ip address and dns which you want next go to your virtual box again and then go to system you need to make settings like this because sometime if you change the settings it might not pick up then for windows 10 and windows 7 the setting should be like this select nat network again click allow all cable connected simple settings then for android especially you must make settings like this otherwise if you choose a different graphics controller or you choose or you enable 3d acceleration or any other thing then it might stop at the console window so it might not give you display right and once you are inside android then in here you can set up the ip addresses like this so thank you for watching this is how you guys can set up your own lab and you can practice but if you are joining if you are a student or joining in future one of our premium courses on cyber security which we provide then you guys will get all these software and a guideline step by step but you are more than welcome to do self study as well any questions you can put in the comments below will be happy to answer thank you for watching